Our products are completely revolutionary. Our Sure Step line of products is all products that the physical therapists um, and parents around the world have been wanting for 30 years. Innovation is required because all, uh, all the work today moves so quickly. We have to have brand new, fresh, contemporary ideas, but they're worthless without uh, closing those opportunities. And execution is very important to us. We focus on cost schedule quality and making sure we get it all done after we create it. We are constantly looking how to make things cheaper, faster, and better with quality being our number one priority. We call it the QQC, quality, quantity, and cost. Conventional blast freezing has, uh, hasn't had a major innovation in 50 years and it's a, it's a huge business. With our system taken off the way it has and you know it, it basically uh, cuts their power bill for the blast freezing in half. One of the other reasons we're excelling at stimulus engineering is again, uh, particularly from the state level and the governor's support is I-69 and its proximity to NSWC Crane. That, uh, that social network, that opening, uh, particularly being the corridor that ties the north and the south parts of the state together and our proximity to that uh, is going to really begin to, it's going to build the traffic that NSWC Crane needs to build its base in the tech park. I think we're um, changing the concept of Hoosiers. Indiana has really pushed to become more international. Uh, we've traveled with Mitch Daniels to China twice now um, and worked with him in that aspect and that's really encouraged businesses to think internationally and think what opportunities are there so um, it's been great to be a part of that. My biggest dream for Indiana is that they continue to be friendly to business. Um, as I look at some of the other states we've looked at going into, um, it's not business friendly. And Indiana so far has been pretty business friendly and we hope that they stay that way. By able to sell out of Indianapolis to a variety of locations, and not only serve, uh, sell it but also support it, be able to communicate with people from all over these countries really tells us that you can success, or you can be a very successful international global company being located in Indianapolis. I think the biggest dream is to really grow the company so that it's recognized nationally. We, I like to tell the story of three generations of a family business, and I, I believe this is uh, it's ultimate the ultimate goal. My biggest dream for state of Indiana is to be recognized as one of the leading states in the country as a state that supports, promotes, and sustains advanced medical device manufacturing. Not only is it a nice place to be, but it's a growing place. It has growth in mind, not only growth in dollars, growth in people, growth in people skills, growth in personal development, growth in outside involvement in associations and communities to be good citizens. That's, that would be my dream. The biggest dream I have for myself in this field is that um, someday when I'm long gone that people remember that I did good things for the field, that we have somehow helped to advance the field to a different level. It's through leadership um, and it's through helping the children. This is what I was destined to do.